Hi everyone, today I would like to show you how to create a setup file or exe file uh, in a Visual Studio 2012. Uh, before creating setup file, first I would like to create a sample project for that. And uh, I'm opening up my Visual Studio 2012. It's a trial version. Yes, and this is my project. It's a just sample project with the two forms. For this, I'm creating a setup file. Yes, this is a form. Okay, I just completed this project. Now I'm creating a setup file for this project. We go to File, New, Project. In this, you observe here other project types. In this setup and deployment, I would like to name it as my first setup and create ok here the setup project is open but it's empty uh, you observe here in the solution explorer uh, it's nothing is here why because uh, basically a visual studio didn't provide you to set up your project so we need to install from website and we need to download from website and after that install uh, I show you how to install where to download uh, go here uh, Visual Studio provides you to download here yeah, this is the website install limited edition for Visual Studio yes come here and download click download yes uh, it's required details of me Let's wait while we submit your request yes yes guys after given details it show me a page to download here the download button just click on this yes you show me a dialog box save file and click on the save file and where you want to store store in your system and install it here the install sheet I would like to install this just open Let's run I'll wait for that. Uh, it takes a longer time to install. I just quit this installation from video. Yes, the installation completed. Now I'm back to my project. Go file and new project. Uh, in this setup and deployment, I select this and I'm tense. Shut down one. Okay. Hey, show me a dialog box. Before installation, we didn't get this. Click simply next. yes this is the window the project assistant these are all the details about how to install now these are the steps these are seven steps to create a setup file uh, simply click next here you can name it as here's the company name application name your application we want to give any version number and your website and if you want to provide any icon just browse here and place the icon here and simply click next uh, here does your application request any specific operating system do you want to uh, run in a particular operating system only just click S yes and click the uncheck the all the things and where you want to install just check the only thing yeah. and here application request any software to be installed if you want to uh, your developer application want to run in a particular operating system do you want to install any particular uh, software just check here and click next uh, this thing only for license versions just ignore this and here uh, this is your product add project outputs uh, no outputs here don't have to read about this click add files yes 
C sharp, my project. Yes, this is a shutdown project. Shutdown, bin, debug, shutdown.exe file. Add here, add it here. I simply click next. Here, if you want to create a shortcut button, say start menu desktop. Create new program file folders, Amsterdam, not name, shutdown.exe. Just to open it, it's happen and check this simply and click next this is also for licensed versions just simply click next here the final step of interview of installation do you want to display your license agreements and company names and want for certain locations do you want to change this you can and find this is the final step observe here this is the icon in the disabled state and simply click on a solution explorer uh, before I'm doing this, I would like to start my stop my virus few minutes because it stops the installation. Click this and install and click yes. Yes, the process in a building state. Yes, the setup was created with the evaluation version of installation. Click OK. This is your product installation. Click Next. Accept. Next. Next. You observe here. App shutdown. I'm name it as install. Yes, my project in install instead. If you want to add uh, database files you can also do it takes me confirmation yes uh, so finish here observe this is my project and this is then how to create a set of project and a visual studio 2012 thanks for watching